Shib Army, Shiba Inu coin family. This is shaping up to be a very interesting and pretty weird week right now in cryptocurrency. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let me clear my throat. Uh, so this is really shaping up to be interesting. Tomorrow, we're going to get CPI data. Big, big day for the overall markets. The stock market is not reacting kindly. Uh, to something we're going to talk about in this video, but crypto is doing pretty well. Shiba Inu dialed back a little bit today, but we're going to learn a lot. And this is a big day tomorrow for Shiba Inu, all the top cryptocurrency projects, stocks, every kind of aspect of the markets. Okay. So we get CPI reading tomorrow. So let me take you inside here. JP Morgan is forecasting lower than expected U.S. CPI data on Thursday and stocks higher. So J.P. Morgan outlines their expected range and attaches probabilities for U.S. CPI for December. J.P. Morgan on why they expect the S&P will gain. Investors are largely defensively positioned. Any evidence that the Federal Reserve's inflation fighting campaign is working will spark a rush to unwind bearish positions. This should aid the nascent bear rally, but we remain cautious as long as the Fed remains active with its tightening cycle. Now, there's a growing sentiment that the Feds might just kick the can down the road a little bit, that they won't raise rates anytime soon, but they will later. So again, we're going to learn a lot more toward the end of this month and see how it impacts top cryptocurrencies like Shiba Inu. Our scenario analysis is skewed bullishly based upon positioning that could cause an overreaction. Oops, what happened there? Uh, could cause an overreaction via short covering on a dovish print. So if we go back to another article that's out there, let me take you right here. Global stocks advance ahead of U.S. inflation. This was early this morning. We've since dialed back down here this afternoon. But let me scroll on down. This is an important point that we're looking at here for tomorrow. This is what we need to really pay close attention to. All right, we are looking at the expectation versus what's going to happen tomorrow. Current expectations are for a 25 basis point rate hike increase at the February meeting and again in March after a 50 basis point hike in December. Now we'll not get we won't get that information tomorrow. What we will get is this information. December CPI uh the, the December CPI is expected to show annual inflation at 6.5% down from 7.1% in November. So this is what we're looking to see. Where does the actual CPI come in according to what's expected at that 6.5%? Now, again, for cryptocurrency, let me take you back inside here. I mean, the crypto market looks pretty strong. Bitcoin over 17.5 right now, continuing its upward trend. Ethereum still over 1,300. We've got Polygon back at 86 cents. Cardano back up over 31 cents. Shiba Inu trying to touch back into the nines here as it has dialed back a little bit. Avalanche has been on a nice tear here in the last 24. Uh, that's one of the top movers here. Avalanche, look at that. XRP is up to 37 cents on a nice little rally. So overall, again, especially with Bitcoin sitting at 17.5, you know, we continue to see some higher prices here. There's the last week here for Bitcoin. Will we get the dramatic sell-off? We will if we get bad news tomorrow. But if it's good news, I think we're going to continue on this rally. Now, again, this is what we're watching for. This is the one-month time frame here for Bitcoin. See this level right here, 18.2. We need to break this. If we could break this to the upside, look out. We might get bullish. And if that happens, I think Shiba Inu will see some nice gains, probably break that zero, and we'll see some of the other altcoins rally with Bitcoin, some of these top altcoins in particular. We're just going to have to wait and find out. But tomorrow's a big, big day for Shib. For all of crypto, especially these top 100 cryptos that are so tied to Bitcoin and Ethereum and for the overall stock market at large. So we'll be watching it very closely. Uh, shout out to Tradix. They're looking really solid a couple of days after their launch. Shout out to them. They're the sponsor of the channel this month and uh, their app is not yet out, but it should be coming uh, out very soon. So excited to see that. And uh, if we take a look at the overall stock market here, let's go to Yahoo Finance real quick before we close out the uh, we close out the video here. Let's take a look here. Real time market insights. Where are we at? Let's just go right over to Yahoo Finance. What do we say here? Huh? Yahoo, Yahoo, <laughs> Yahoo Finance. Boom. All right. Let's 
break in here real quick. All right, so actually, yeah, markets actually pick back up here. Okay, so markets are actually looking good here this afternoon. So, wow, uh, BlackRock plans to cut 500 workers after last year's market downturn. That's not good. But, uh, yeah, S&P, it's up. Dow's up. Okay, so things are trending up here in the stock market this afternoon. It'll be interesting to kind of see what happens here. You can see Bitcoin, some of the top cryptos, they are up. Uh, trending tickers right now. AMC is up. Airbnb, Carvana. Wow, Carvana looking nice. Lucid, Lucid Group, up, Upstart. Um, Tesla's up a little bit. Amazon's up. Uh, everything's up a little bit. So that's good to see. Look at AMC up uh, 18%. Though. That's nice for all the apes over there with AMC. So we'll see what happens tomorrow. We're going to learn a lot as it relates to Shiba Inu, all the top cryptocurrencies. We'll be here covering it for you. Don't miss anything stay locked in subscribe right here appreciate you guys so much for stopping back by the channel love you guys and uh, we'll see you in the next video